Yeah, it's, there we go. <laughs> yep, you too. Snow Canyon State Park. This place is amazing. When I see this place, it makes me want to sing like Pocahontas, you know, like. Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Okay, that was more, uh, Gloria, what is her name? Gloria Childs? <laughs> Gloria Stefan? <laughs> no, Julia, Julia Childs. Yeah. This is Canyonland State Park. <laughs> This is, let me try that again. This is Snow Canyon State Park. And the reason why I'm riding here today and doing a little moto vlog next to these amazing rock formations and these delectable sand dunes is because I am filled with massive gratitude. And that gratitude is gonna be paid forward shortly. First of all, this is my quasi submission for the random acts of coolness. Ride Victoria, thank you so much for the inspiration and to just go out and do something awesome. It's just so freaking cool. That's probably really loud coming out your speakers. Like coming out your speakers. It's coming out your speakers. Don't know what I'm talking about. Back on topic. I'm so stinking grateful for Mr. Rohonek and Mr. Duff Factor taking my bike away, fixing it. I guess they're painting it. Uh, the last picture I saw, it was primer gray. Those guys are so stinking awesome and I want to thank you guys for contributing to their ever ride extreme makeover edition motorcycle edition if you guys donated thank you very much i am overwhelmed with gratitude when it comes to that i made a promise that as much money was donated to that project i felt it was unfair that that money wasn't going to a better cause and so people who did donate because they're really cool people i told them that i would match it and that match is gonna go to some awesome causes. And I would match it in hours spent in service and money as well. Now, I don't know how much that has raised, but I can tell you something. I've got a little project in the works. Actually, it's not in the works, it's done. What I decided to do is actually not really a random act of coolness. It's not really random. I see a lot of cool people doing really personable things for people. And I wanted to do something like that. And I, I literally lost sleep over this, you guys. I racked my brain to find out something that I could do that was maybe a little bit bigger than myself. Our moto vlogging community has the opportunity to do some serious, serious good. As evidenced by Mr. Benjamin Brawley, Mr. Benjamin Brawley has, as of today, 11,000 votes, I believe, to help him get his mobility van. And I really think he's going to do it. I think that as a community, we should all go to the website, and I'll put it below, and get that kid 100,000 votes by the time this is over. Because you can vote every day. Anyway, on to the main juice. The main, the main juice. <laughs> the main meat. The main meat of this moto vlog is to tell you about MotorcycleVideo.org. Now this is a website that I've set up. I'm not much of a designer. I'm not much of a web person. So in all of this thinking of how I was going to create something that was a little bigger than myself, and at the same time voting for Mr. Brawley to get his mobility van, I realized that we as moto vloggers have a lot of power. We have a lot of power for good. It shows in the donations that uh, I've seen accidental broadcast get. It shows in the donations to send j Rad off-road to school. It shows in the donations that Mr. Rohonek received to fix my motorcycle. You guys are a giving group of people. And it shows in the sharing of content and the sharing of community and the kind comments. You guys, moto vlogging is a seriously cool community. I wanted to kind of tap into that power to see if we could start something just to oh, really bow, bow, pinja bow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> something that's just like something like that so I put together a website called motorcyclevideo.org 
You go to the website, you input your YouTube username, and then there's a little script that automatically uploads everything that you upload onto the site. Now, this does a couple of things. If you are a viewer, you will find a lot of variety and a lot of really awesome new moto vloggers to subscribe to and find out. If you are a moto vlogger, you are, you are tough. If you are a moto vlogger, you will find a massive new audience, hopefully, to be exposed to. If your videos are good, you're gonna get uh, some subscribers, right? But not only that, it does some serious good. Some ba ki ta ba Serious good. I am terrible at writing with no hands. Someday, someday, someday I'll learn wheelies and no handwriting. <laughs> So terrible. Here's the good part. The site gets ad revenue. Eventually, maybe we'll do some t-shirts or something. All of the ad revenue that the site receives goes straight into some really good causes. We've got Fisher House, Wounded Warrior Project, Toys for Tots, UNICEF. They are basically like military service and child children's service charities. BACA. BACA is another one of them. These are worthy causes, and all of the ad revenue that that site brings in goes right to those causes, okay? Which is cool. And you might say, well, what about my YouTube revenue? I won't get paid for my ads. You will, you will. Because your ads still show up on the videos, and then there's the site ads on the side. So everybody benefits from this, okay? So as a moto vlogger, you wanna go there and submit your very best videos. No crap, okay? No garbage on this site, because you wanna grow your audience. Now, if you submit crap, first of all, nobody's gonna want to come and subscribe to you and second of all it's just taking up space on the on the site okay so submit your best work if you submit like Sistine Chapel type stuff like your very best that you can do you're gonna get a load load of people coming to you you go to the site you type in your YouTube username and your YouTube channel URL click submit and then you're done now here's the cool thing to bring people to motorcyclevideo.org and so there's the maximum amount of good done we want to to provide you with some badges. Badges? Badges? We don't need no stinking badges. No, I'm not talking about badges like honey badger. Honey badger, dude. I think I don't give a c We're not talking about honey badgers. We're talking about like badges. Like a little image that you can put on your videos or that you can put on your YouTube avatar or that you can put on your YouTube channel art. So if you check out my avatar, you're gonna see in the corner a little MV down here at the side. Hey. If you look on my video, you're gonna see a little watermark right there down in the bottom right corner. These are badges that you can download and incorporate into your art to show that you are a supporter of MotorcycleVideo.org. There are different ways that you could do it. You can put the link in your description. You don't have to use any of the images. You don't have to do any of this, but it would certainly help. And it's a cool thing to be part of a good cause. Incorporate those things into your videos, put them on your avatars and whatnot, show people that you are a supporter, and let's bring a lot of people to MotorcycleVideo.org. Now here's the thing, I'm not gonna make money from this. This. I have other avenues, potential avenues of making money. I'll find a job soon. This is completely charity based, okay? There's no there's no incentive other than to get this community doing something incredible for people who need it, okay? So go to motorcyclevideo.org. Put in your username and your channel URL, it's super simple. And then download some of those badges. There's a 1080p watermark down here. Is this thing in the way? Does it obstruct anything, this little guy down here? I don't think so. It's completely clear and it just goes right into the corner. It looks really nice and it shows people that you're uh, you're part of a better cause. Really, it's a win-win because you still get your AdSense revenue. MotorcycleVideo.org gets AdSense revenue, which in turn it donates straight to these charities. Let's be engaged in a good cause and let's do this thing, okay? With MotorcycleVideo.org, that gives us all a little chance to do just a very little bit of work and have really awesome actions. So please go right now to MotorcycleVideo.org, enter your YouTube username, enter your YouTube channel URL, and download some of those badges to put in your video. There's other suggestions on the page of things that you can do 
to spread some of the awareness of this thing. But really, this is a cool thing to do because you don't need to donate anything yourself. You don't need to do anything extra. All you do is put your channel and URL on that site, and then the good starts happening because you let it. Let's get this party started. For those of you uh, who are new moto vloggers, I hope to see you on there. For those of you who are established and amazing moto vloggers already, I really hope to see you on there. And for those of you, I better stop talking with my hands because the cop just pulled out. Burp, burp. And for those of you who are avid YouTube moto vlogger watchers, I hope to see you guys on there too, getting your content from there, finding new and awesome people to, you know, watch, finding, uh, great content. So you guys signing out. Have a ride. Ow.